Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, I thought today's video would be a good little like switch up, you know? So I know that some of you guys have requested like a news type of lip combos video. So I definitely wanted to do something for you guys. So if you are a nude lip lover, then this is definitely gonna be your jam. So uh, Mented Cosmetics, they sent me their collection of nude lipsticks. So uh, it's mostly for like, you know, women of color, that kind of like nude lip combination. And I'm down to like try some for you guys. So they do have about six lipsticks that I've got here. And they come in various different shades of browns and pinky mauvey colors that are really gonna work well for people of color or honestly anybody, you could still rock this. I'm gonna try them alone. There is about one pink shade that I think I might need to use brown aligner, which I'm just gonna use MAC Chestnut because I feel like everybody just has that liner. Um, but anyway, enough of me rambling. <laughs> if you're brand spanking new here and you like beauty videos, click that subscribe button. It should be right here. Yes, right here. I think I got the right side. <laughs> and if you're an oldie but a goodie subby, hey girl, it is so good to see you again. So all right, let's get to it. So uh, this color here, it's called a Dope Taupe. It's super, super pretty. And I think that you can just wear this alone. If you're a lip liner person and you're like, listen, I can't put nothing on my lips without some lip liner, then you can go ahead and do that. Otherwise, you can just put this on. One thing for sure I can tell you guys, look at this color, super creamy, looks so beautiful on my skin tone and I think it's gonna look beautiful on anybody. This is definitely something that I can see wearing every single freaking day. Dope Topaz, gorgeous, damn. Makes my lips look like hella juicy too. <laughs> um, like I said, super creamy, that's what I love about a formula because especially around the winter time, fall and winter, my lips get really, really dry. Just having big lips, they get chapped, you know? So I love that they just go on really, really, really creamy. So. So far, first shade is good. Let's go on to the second shade. Now, the second shade here is called Pretty in Pink. I wanna try this alone for you guys, but if not, I'm just gonna, if it doesn't work out, basically, I'm just gonna add a brown liner. Hmm. This is actually really, really pretty. Um, for some of you guys that really like bright pink lipstick, this is going to be amazing. And actually, instead of brown, I do have a kind of berry-ish liner, so I'm going to add that. This is from Absolute New York in, there's no color, it just says perfect pair. It's like a pinky color, and I'm going to add this. So now that I added this darker color outside, it's kind of like a beautiful pink ombre. Looks gorgeous. Like, I'm looking at this like, mm, okay, I'm gonna need my husband to take me out tonight because uh, look at this, I can't let this go to waste, you know? Again, pretty in pink, and so far it looks really good. Let me know what you guys think of each of these shades, whether you would rock them or not, and if you have tried anything else from Mented Cosmetics, let me know, because uh, maybe I need to try out more stuff too. The third lipstick I have here is called Nude La La. I love the name. Okay, so let's see what this bad boy looks like. Ooh, this one is really, really cute. Um, I love this. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of um, Anastasia Beverly Hills Lip Gloss in Sepia, which is one of my favorite, favorite colors. But it's like the lipstick form, so it's like hella creamy. Mm. And you guys notice how I'm wearing more of a dramatic eye color and all of these lip colors so far have gone really nicely with this. So. I love it. I love it. I love it. Mm, it just 
it looks scrumptious. And what I love about this collection so far is that all of these are work or school appropriate, so you can still look cute, but uh, you know, it's not inappropriate for everyday wear. So now we're getting into the darker chocolatey shades. This one here is called Dark Night. Loving this name. <laughs> so let's see what this looks like on uh, my skin tone. So this shade is definitely like your standard chocolate shade. I really, really love it. Same formula, very creamy, goes on really nice, feels good on the lips. It feels like really moisturizing on the lips because by now it's the fourth shade and my lips were feeling a little dry before, but this feels really nice and comfy. Doesn't emphasize any texture or like um, if your lips are chapped or something like that. It looks really really good and you know for anybody that's like a lighter complexion than me this could be really good lipstick for like a vampy kind of look you know if you want a nice chocolate hued lipstick Dark Nights is the one and you don't even need a liner for most of these um this one definitely doesn't even need a liner but I'm feeling it now the fifth shade I'm gonna try on for you guys this one is called Foxy Brown. <laughs> so this is really, really cute. Obviously, it's another brown color. It looks to be a little lighter than Dark Night, but let's see what it looks like on. Sometimes I feel like the best way to try a lip color is to see what it looks like on you because it could look completely different than in the tube. So this brown definitely has some more like reddish tones, like a reddish brown. Um, I think it's gorgeous. I think personally I would prefer to wear it with a little bit of a chocolatey liner, but it's still beautiful, um, still creamy, slightly less creamy than the shade Dark Night, but it still works really, really nicely, complements the skin tone. I'm feeling it, you know. And yeah, I feel like <laughs> Foxy Brown makes me think of, of course, there's the 70s um, actress. Yes, I think it's the 70s actress. Or am I thinking of somebody else? Let me know. <laughs> but I also am thinking of the rapper who I love. So the name is near and dear to my heart. <laughs> and the sixth shade is called Mented Number five it's another dark brown shade it looks to have some hues of red in it as well and let me put this on so you guys can see what it looks like Ooh, I really like this one it's like a mix between dark brown and a mauve color and it's less uh, what is that it's like a not as creamy it has almost a matte feel, but it's like a demi-matte. That would be the best way to describe it. Really, really nice. Um, I'm loving it. So with that being said, let me know what you guys thought of this nude lip collection. I'll have all the information down below for you in the description box and links and stuff if you guys are interested in purchasing them. Um, really loving it so far. Um, I just, I'm so glad now I have a whole collection of nude lipsticks to play with. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope it was really helpful for those of you guys that are looking for more nude lips to play around with. Um, let me know some video suggestions of what you guys want to see. I love you guys. Don't forget to check out these videos if you want to chill with me some more and hang out. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!